Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? In this video, I'm going to share with you all the editing software that I'm using as a beginner. All the softwares are free and there is no watermark. Stay tuned, it's coming up. On my last video of YouTube series, I, I told you that I'm going to share with you how, what software I use to edit my videos. And uh, if you haven't checked my last video, please, it's, it's gonna be notification, please go and check. Uh, it's about what equipment you need to start your new YouTube channel. In this series, I'm going to explain you what editing software I'm using. They are no watermark, easy to use, and I'm going to share with you um, the editing software that for some different devices. So whatever device you use is gonna cover you back. The first one I would like to recommend InShot. InShot is a mobile app you can download on ISO or Android devices. Um, you can easily take a picture from your phone and make the editing right away. It got a lot of, lot of features. I love them. It got stickers, music, filters, you, you just name it. You can have your own music or you can, you know, put the effects if you want any kind of, you know, bottle effect or any kind of effect. You can just add them. There are a lot of stickers. I love the stickers part and they're live stickers. Also, there is a handle for the Facebook so, or Instagram, whatever you like to add. You can easily add them straight away. Or you can just add the text, whatever, what happened on, uh, you know, Final Cut Pro or uh, iMovie. Uh, there, you cannot move the text around, but uh, uh, with InShot, you just easily move the text around. You can add different font, you can resize the text, it's really easy. And also, you double click that um, the text and you can literally um, choose where you wanted to put the end of the clip or end of the video the text will go according to that you know like you double click and it goes I love them it, you can go for a filter there are a lot of lot of different filters but you need to pay for the filter the problem is uh, for filters you need to get the paid version but I don't think it's worth it because it you literally can go to adjust and make your own filter. I think it's way better that add your colors by yourself way than pay six pound every month for you know little filter. Another great feature is trim. You can literally go to the trim um, or cut or split. It's it's great you know and also you can crop. Um, you can rotate. Also you have shortcut for split. Um, or duplicate you know it's easy for quick adjustment you can add background any color you want I just want to make it plain black also you can adjust the ratio according to your needs I need to make it a little bit bigger I will make it that also I need to rotate as I cannot see my text and it doesn't look really appealing so I will rotate the video there you have it it's quick and easy you know it's simple and yet very professional you will love them if you have any time issue you can quickly adjust a video and put it through to the social media If you're using Apple devices, I will recommend you to use iMovie. iMovie will cover your basics. They have everything you need to edit a video, quality video, not only video, quality video. They have transition, they have lots of background, um, they have really good color correction process. You can crop the 
screen or record your voice over there filters you know the the whole procedure you know or uh, i'm not gonna go through in detail because there are a lot of lot of features there are a lot of uh, videos regarding iPov in, in the youtube you can go ahead and check or if you want me to make any tutorial i can do that cover you all the basics yet very very professional a lot of youtuber actually use at the beginning um at least one year they use iMovie if they use they have Apple device they use iMovie you can use back uh, green screen blue screen you can use 3d it's easy to use fast fully cooked um, you know software you don't need anything else if you have iMovie if you use Windows PC or Windows devices then you should go for Windows Movie Maker it's very basic uh, they have very basic features actually it's not my favorite but if you have only options using Windows then you can go for Windows Movie Maker Again, I'm not going to go for in detail about it has a lot of features and if I want to explain each of them, it's going to be never ending, ending video. You can also get a lot of lot of um, tutorial on uh, YouTube how to use uh, Windows Movie Maker. They have uh, plenty of uh, features. If you want me to make any tutorial, I can do that. You can add background. There are a lot of filters. You can add your music. You can uh, cut and crop. It give you know it covers all the basics. I'm going to leave all the link in description down below. Please go ahead and download for yourself. If you have any recommendation, please leave them on the comment below so I can try them. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Video next. <sighs> if you enjoy this channel, no. Okay, hello.